Hi, my name is Abdur Rahman from Apple Systems and I'll be going over some of the relational and equality operators in Mapware 7000. The relational operators include greater than, greater than or equal to, less than, less than or equal to. The equality operators include equal to and the not equal to. First, let's scroll over to an empty subroutine and examine where these operands are located. Hover over the Compare tab. These are the operands that we will be covering in this tutorial. Now let's place each one on the screen and see what they all look like. So let's place the greater than ladder instruction and then the greater than or equal to and now the equal to and the not equal to the less than and lastly the less than or equal to instruction. Now that we know where all these instructions are let's scroll over to screen 1 and observe how they work. Let's also place the appropriate ladder logic subroutine to the right of the screen. How the ladder instructions work is very simple. First observe that both rungs in the logic block begin with a coil and that coil is always turned on. The always on coil enables the instruction to execute on every scan. As soon as operand A is greater than operand B, the output line is energized and the output coil is turned on. The same is true for the greater than or equal to instruction and it works very similarly. When operand A is greater than or equal to operand B, the output coil is turned on. Let's scroll over to screen 2 and examine additional relational operators. Let's also place the appropriate lateral logic subroutine to the right of the screen. The always on coil enables the instructions to execute on every scan. So as soon as operand A is less than operand B, the output coil is turned on. Similarly, as operand A is less than or equal to operand B, the output coil is turned on. Let's go to screen 3 and examine the equality operators. Let's also place the appropriate lateral logic subroutine on the right of the screen. The always on coil enables the instruction to execute on every scan. So as soon as operand A is equal to operand B, it will turn on the output coil. The same is true for the not equal to operator. As soon as both operands do not equal each other, the output coil is turned on. Now let's go to the HMC and observe how the relational and equality operators work. On screen 1, as soon as operand A is greater than operand B, the output coil is turned on. When operand A is greater than or equal to operand B, the output coil is turned on. Now let's click on the next button and go to screen number 2. When operand A is less than operand B, the output coil is turned on. And when operand A is less than or equal to operand B, the output coil is turned on. Let's click the next button and go to screen number 3. When operand A is equal to operand B, the output coil is turned on. And lastly, when operand A is not equal to operand B, the output coil is turned on.